What's going on you guys? This is a Max KDI or another Dell Optiplex 9020. This is the small form factor upgrades. So first you're gonna do is remove the side cover panel. This little latch right here. And you're gonna start off from the hard drive. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna disconnect the SATA and power cable here. And you're gonna do this little clip right here, you press it up right here gently with your finger and it will slide the hard, the optical drive will slide to the left. And you're gonna disconnect the SATA and power for the hard drive. And you got a, there's a little clip right here, secure clip, uh, locks the, uh, the cage, uh, hard drive cage. What you're gonna do is you take it, you're gonna take your finger and you're gonna press it to the left like this to unlock it. And the, the hard drive, cage will lift up like this and you're gonna disconnect uh, the hard drive caddy a 3.5 inch and we upgrade upgraded to another hard drive so you're gonna go like this install it back so this is the older hard drive and this is the newer one and install it back like this and just connect it back you're gonna connect back the SATA and power cable and you're gonna secure lock the little clip right here right to the right side to lock it and now I'm gonna show you guys how to upgrade to solid state drive so you're gonna connect disconnect again the so the SATA and power cable Now, what you need is, uh, you have to buy uh, the plastic caddy that sells online. It's for Dell, uh, 3.5 inch to 2.5 inch solid state drive caddy. And you can just install any solid state drive you want. It will fit any 2.5 inch solid state drive. Or, you can use, uh, it will also fit a 2.5 inch hard drive for the laptop it will also fit in here. It's the same size as a solid state drive. So I'm going to go ahead and install the solid state drive. Now I'm going to take the regular 3.5 inch caddy and connect it like this. Now we're gonna connect back to the cage. And now I want to do guys is show I'm gonna upgrade the memory. And there's a little clip where you take your finger like this gently pressing down here the clips and remove the memory. And I'm going to be upgrading to 8 gigs dual channel uh, DDR3 1600. This is for the 9 ACC for desktop. The memory I like is a Carsec, Kingston, and Crucial. Those are the top three brands. And when you install the memory properly, you're going to hear two clicks. So the memory is installed, dual channel 8 gigs. Now I'm going to install back the hard drive cage and you're gonna connect back the SATA and power to, to the SSD like this so now we installed the solid state drive now we're gonna install back the optical drive And connect back to SATA and power. And it'll be the last part is upgrade a video card. So to do that, I'm gonna switch to the other side so you guys can see better like this. And there's a little latch which you can take your finger like this and press this up. And you're gonna remove the one PCI bracket because we're gonna be installing the video card through PCI Express times 16 slot right here, the blue slot. And the video card guys I'm going to be using is uh, AMD Radeon HD 
7570. This is the low profile with low profile bracket. It's got a DVI port and a display port, but they do sell adapters. You can go to, from display port to HDMI. You can get those adapters online. And or you can use the video card AMD Radeon uh, HD 8490, the low profile with low profile bracket will work. So let me go and install the video card. So the video card is installed. Now I'm gonna do is gonna install back the latch here, and we put the side cover back on. And you're done. I'll show you guys the front side. This is the small foam factor. I'll show you the back. And this is the back side. This is the video car is installed. And what you guys are gonna do is uh, get the drivers. You gotta go to AMD website. If you guys are gonna be using the same video card, you can go to AMD website and get the drivers for the video card. If you install our first operating system, get the drivers for it and restart the computer. Install uh, the memoir monitor. You're gonna connect it directly either to DVI or DisplayPort. So you guys, this is the end of the video. This is a Max KDI here. This is for the Dell Optiplex 9020 small phone factor. Thanks for watching. Bye.